Why, hello, friends. Crafty Mama here. Hope you are all doing well. I'm here to share a kit I recently purchased. It's the Crafter's Companion Floral Decoupage Kit. And it has over 275 individual elements that I'd share it with you in case you might be interested in getting one yourself. It comes with this beautiful ribbon in three different shades. Everything coordinates in the kit. But not only do you get three different shades of ribbon, you get three different sizes, widths of ribbon. So that is nice. You also get the assorted pearls, 100 pieces in the different colors as well. Again, everything coordinates. And you get these decoupage sheets. There's 48 total. There's 24 of the hydrangeas and 24 of the roses. Absolutely stunning and gorgeous. So you can make 3D flowers. Also in the kit, you get a die set. There are 19 metal dies in the set, which includes words and some decorative elements. And those actually can cut out the decoupage sheets, both the hydrangeas and the roses. There's also a clear stamp set with the flowers on it. And those also will coordinate with the dies. You can cut out, you can stamp it out yourself once you're done with the decoupage sheets and use the dies to cut out the ones you stamp out yourself, which is really cool. So you can keep going. Then you get additional clear stamp set that includes a lot of nice phrases like if friends were flowers, I'd pick you. Friends are the family we choose for ourselves. Today is all about you, cherish the moment, and all kinds of things like that, as you can see. You also get card blanks, 18 of those in three different sizes. Those sizes are five by seven, four and a quarter by five and a half, and five by five square. And of course you get the coordinating envelopes to go with the card blanks. There is also printed paper that comes in this kit, and I'll show you each of those. Now you get two each of these sheets, but I'll just show you one at a time. And that way you can see all the pretty designs, but you do get two each of every sheet I'm showing you here in the kit. And again, everything just, I love how it flows and coordinates and the colors and the floral prints. And like, this is a really like whitewashed wood look print, which is really neat. So you get a lot of different things that you can use to make cards. I mean, you get 18 card blanks with the kit, so right off the bat, you can make 18, but using your own supplies, you can just keep going. Now, the printed papers, like I said, you get two of each. There's 24 total of the printed papers, and I just love, oh, this is just such a pretty print, the rose print. And then you get muted, color, muted things and pastels, and here's a green uh, diamond print, like a washed look of a diamond print. This is just another printed uh, paper, pretty color. And then you also get sheets that are colored card sheets. These are solid coordinating colors and you get 20 pieces of the card sheets. As you can see, you get 10 different colors and I lined them all up here because they're solid, but you can see the beautiful array of tones and colors and pinks and mauve and you get the purples and there's greens, there's even white in there. And again, just wonderful colors to mix and match and coordinate with the printed papers. Now, there is one thing I did want to tell you. You see on this card, the decoupage card, there's little numbers next to each one of those little decoupage images. And they work with the dies. I'll show you in a minute. It's also on this one for the roses. You'll see the little A1, A2, A3, and so on. And what it is in the die set, look at this die set, and I'll show you. There's little tabs on each of the dies. They don't cut out when you cut out the die, but there's a little tab and it has a number which coordinates with the decoupage number on each sheet. So you know exactly what die to use to cut out for that particular sheet. So that's really nice. You don't, there's no guesswork here. So the other thing is too, and I'm gonna show you in a second, a tip or a hint that I have, because the stamp set that you get not all the dies, there's only like four or five dies that go with the stamp set. So you have the other dies that you use for the decoupage cards. What are you going to do with them once you're done with the decoupage cards? Well, I figured out right away what I'm going to do between me and you. I put these on a piece of copy paper and I am going to scan them with my Viewpoint Magic Wand scanner. You can use whatever scanner you have. Maybe you have one similar to this. 
take it to my copy center and print out more copies so I can keep going with the decoupage. So between the 48 decoupage sheets that I have, I can make 48 cards unless I want to put more than one 3D flower on it. Of course, I'll make glass, but I can make a minimum of 48 cards if I just use one per card. And of course, I have my die set that coordinates with them and the stamp set. And I can stamp my own images and color them, color them in and cut them out with the die set. And then if I also make my own copies of the colored decoupage sheets, I could just keep going and going. And I get a lot of use and a lot of cards and a lot of projects because I don't just have to use it on cards. I can make MDC um, cards pretty. I can make HTC cards with this set. I could put them on tags. I could put them on in my journals, lots of things. So as you can see, you could get a lot of use out of this one kit and have a lot of fun with it. Now you can find this kit on scrapbook.com. You can even find it on walmart.com, Etsy, and eBay, ranging in price from $24 to $27. I love kits that give you a lot of bang for your buck, and I think this one does. I'll include a couple of links to a couple of places that you can find it at below. And if you'd like to see me make one of these cards with this set, just leave a comment below and I'll try to put up a video so you can see what a couple of the cards look like. Thanks for stopping by and watching Crafty Mom. I hope you have the best day ever. Until next time, next video. Bye-bye.